far would you take a ride on an auto rickshaw from work to home or to a hospital? Here is a young man from South India who took it from Bangalore to the Buckingham Palace all the way up to London, 14,000 kilometers on a tuk-tuk. You shouldn't miss this inspiring story. The dust has settled, the tyres are resting. After running a marathon of over 14,000 kilometres, it is now showtime for this stunner. Refurbished from its original form of an auto rickshaw, this tuk-tuk was born to make a difference. It is a fuel-free, solar-operated electric vehicle, the only one in the world which has travelled 13 countries in just seven months. Naveen Rabeli, a 35-year-old engineer from Hyderabad, set off on a journey from Bangalore to get to the Buckingham Palace in London. The queen, though, for the moment, is his tuk-tuk, on display and turning eyeballs at a prestigious low-carbon car exhibition in the UK. Uh, for me, it was more important to show to the people that, you know, uh, this kind of technology can uh, is reliable uh, over long distance of uh, kilometres and different terrains, different conditions. Naveen set off on this journey from India to the UK to spread the message on renewable energy and a zero pollution travel. I have um, really good experiences in uh, Iran. People have been absolutely friendly. Um, the food was great in uh, Turkey and uh, in Greece. Um, where they like? I like really like the uh, beaches and stuff. It was a really good holiday. And in Germany, I really like the technology. I mean, it sounds like a crazy thing to do, but it's, it's, it's those kind of things that change the world. It's those kind of people that engage, you know, the, the young generation. To, for, from innovation to technology transfer, we need people like Naveen. There are two things that Naveen's journey teaches us. A, that this is a reliable means of transport, and B, and the bigger lesson for me, is that the world, after all, is not such a bad place and people are forthcoming to help. Radhika Ayer from the UK, NDTV.